Asian carp found in the Illinois River are large, much too plentiful, and, says Travis Lloyd, deputy director of the Illinois Department of Natural Resources, it's ugly. The fish is predominantly not a pretty fish. But Louisiana chef Philippe Parola strongly disagrees. This fish is just as good looking as a salmon or a lake trout or any other. So quit calling it ugly because it's not ugly. No matter how the fish looks, Parola and fellow chef Tim Crehan are teaming up with Illinois state officials in a campaign to whet the public's appetite for the Asian carp. So it's very palatable, very pleasing when you taste it. We've got to show people that this fish tastes good, it can be worked with pr preparation-wise, and this fish can be very servable, very edible in every capacity. Asian carp is widely consumed in China, but most fish eaters in the United States avoid it because they confuse it with native carp. These fish are bottom feeders that many people believe are contaminated by toxic pollutants, including mercury. But Asian carp, which are not really carp at all, feed on plankton and algae near the surface of rivers and lakes. That is why they're often seen jumping out of the water. Travis Lloyd says Asian carp is a clean fish with low levels of mercury that's safe to eat. We've tested it. The levels are, in most cases, nil, uh, and it is the safest fish. Another reason many Americans avoid eating Asian carp is that it's bony, difficult to fillet, and hard to sell in fresh fish markets. But Chef Crean says when the fish is cooked, the bones come out easily enabling food processors to package it as a ready-to-serve product. Better still, says Crean, Asian carp is cheap. The average price per pound of ocean fish is $6 a pound whole. This is looking at 12 to 20 cents. So this is so affordable that the food banks we've talked to are like, oh, we could never think about serving fish because we just can't afford it. This makes a fish that's affordable. Travis Lloyd hopes greater interest in Asian carp as a food product will cause it to be more heavily fished out of lakes and streams. He says that would not only reduce pressure on native fish species and the fragile Great Lakes ecosystem, but would also provide an economic boost at a time when unemployment in Illinois is high. We recognize this could create a lot of jobs. It could bring back commercial fishing in Illinois. It could absolutely uh, help our food insecurity if we could come up with a product viable, go through the food, uh, food bank system, and possibly even into the diets of, of school system, the prison systems, things of that nature. It could take some time before consumers see Asian carp on the menu in restaurants or in grocery store freezers. In fact, they may not see Asian carp at all if Chef Parola is successful. He has licensed the term silverfin and hopes the name catches on in the campaign to give this invasive fish a new image. Kane Fairbaugh, VOA News, Chicago.